I want to take you on a behind the scenes look of a Connect Visualization Services application for a water utility. So when they open up their application right here in the cloud, they click water from within Connect Visualization Services, and they see the pre-configured displays and layout of all the different information from multiple different regions that are now brought up to the cloud. And you can see on the home page, for instance, multiple different sites, multiple different underlying sources about consumption, drinking water, wastewater, even stormwater, you know, weather data, all is brought into this single application for them. So they don't need to open multiple different pieces of software. If someone wants to see a geospatial view, say of the North region, they're brought right into a screen that has everything from leakage information to region information, from the KPIs to real time trends on the right. And when they want to dive one step further and actually get dashboards of different zones from the woodlands to upper thompson they have the key kpis the water consumption the leakages the zone information that they can bring up with a single click and then we want to see these trends over time of course it's not just the kpis this has a foundation of connect data services where all of the real-time data resides so in addition to showing those trends it can also show current values, any historical ranges that they're interested in. And it can do this for multiple pieces of equipment. You're working at DMAs, they wanna change this view to pumps. Again, connect visualization services, services up all the data in exactly the right display arrangement and with the colors and symbols that they need to be able to make quick sense of all of the thousands and thousands of data streams that this water utility is monitoring. Now, it's not just about these regions and the DMAs and pumps. Connect Visualization Services can also offer other insights into their data and other ways of presenting it. And if we actually move you know, out of the different regional view, we can explore some other options here on the lower menu. So from the home page, uh, we'd started looking at you know the different regions, but if they'd wanted to investigate a different area, they can do another click and now look at different water systems. Okay, drinking water, wastewater, storm water, and again, clicking on any of these brings them to current KPIs, efficiencies, discharge pressures, uh, which is customized by the different system that they're looking at. Watersheds presented differently from storm water, from drinking water. Connect Visualization Services takes all that data, which at each physical site in each physical zone is coming from multiple different systems and controllers and sensors, but it's unifying all this in these displays that let them access all this data at their fingertips requiring only a cloud connection and a web browser. And they finally want to look at this last screen right here, quality, and see everything from customer complaints to area ratings. Again, under the hood, this is so many different systems and sources and pieces of equipment that's all physically generating this data. But the point of Connect Visualization Services and the Connect Industrial Cloud Platform is that it's liberating this data from the silos and the physical locations where it sits on site and bringing it to the users at this water utility so that they can apply their insights and their expertise and their years of training and working with these assets to understanding their data now that they have it in a much easier to work with and unified experience. And that right there is the power of the Connect Industrial Cloud Platform, delivering these kinds of visualizations with Connect Visualization Services and more. And if you have questions about how you could apply Connect to your site or your organization, reach out. We'd love to have those conversations with you. Thank you.